Hello! I've been gone. <laughs> I'm aware. Um, I haven't made any new videos as of recently. I've been, um, busy. Life and such. What's up? Also, my hair is no longer blonde. I, it was supposed to be black, but the pigment separated in the container. So now I got this, this like blueberry thing going on where some of it's purple and some of it's blue. And I don't know why. <laughs> I, I don't know why, but I do know why. And I'm not mad about it. I actually kind of like how it turned out. It's not black, but it's cool. Like, I mean, it's cool to me. I, li I think it's cool and I like it. So yeah. Okay, so today is a very, well, it's not a very special video. It's a video, um, but it's 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 going to be a fun video, hopefully, uh, because I got the Gorillaz art book in, and I, I've already opened the box. I haven't seen anything yet. I haven't, like, dug out all the paper and plastic and shit. Um, but, yeah, I've already opened the box, and I want to, we're going to, like, kind of look through it together and yada yada. Kind of what I did with the almanac, but hopefully a little better. Now that I have a kind of a setup, I don't have like an overhead camera, so I'm just gonna try to tilt my webcam carefully <laughs> and see if I can't capture my desk for you guys. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna tilt you also, you know, don't freak out or anything. Tilting and tilting and tilting. Tilting and tilting and tilting. Eh, sorry. Adjustments have to be made. How's that? I'm sure it'll fall at some point, and hopefully I notice before it does. Okay, so here's the box. So we're gonna open it up. I don't have a whole lot of room going on right now, so I'm gonna do my best. Also, I'm sorry if it gets a little loud. Um, I guess I can move my mic a little bit. I just worry that the audio will, I worry that the audio will be kind of on the quiet side. So, oh, did I open this up the wrong way? Was I supposed to open it the other way? Um, okay, so what's this? Your gorilla's art book is printed on high quality paper and carefully and sensitively bound, then packed and sealed before being shipped to you. When you open your book package, please allow your book to acclimatize to the humidity in your environment. It will need to breathe and settle for a few days. What? <laughs> I've never, I've never, what? I've never heard of a book needing to do that. Is this book fine wine? <laughs> Am I missing something? Okay, so that's interesting. All right, so I'm gonna take the book out and then I'll move the box since the box is, you know, yeah. Why is there a quote from Ace on the back? <laughs> and all it says is Ace. Hang on. Sorry, loud. Alright, let's get this out of the way. Down there on the floor. Okay, so we have the art book. And y'all gotta look at it upside down. Sorry, but you did. Okay, so now we're gonna t take the plastic off. Acclimatized to the humidity in your environment. I'm still stuck on that because that was I've never seen that before. I've never even heard people having to do that for books. I wonder if it's serious or. Ooh, wait, this packaging is kind of cool. What's happening? Are these the pages? Those are pages. I thought this was like a case and the book was inside of it because that's what it kind of looked like. Get out of here, Jiffy Lou. Sorry, shaking y'all. Starting to tilt a little. That's okay. Yeah, okay, so I thought this was a case, but these are actually the pages. <laughs> um, so we have the front of the book, and we have the spine of the book, and we got the back of the book, which is just the bench. Oh, and then fucking uh, right there, Ace's on the, over on the other side, it just says Ace, and it's a quote for me. <laughs> What are the other quote? The other. Oh, wait, are they. Re Why is Ace's review just Ace? Well, I guess it can go both ways. Uh, slightly heavier than a watermelon. Very satisfying by anonymous. 
So good I stitched my ear back on Vincent Van Gogh. The best falafel in West London, but service can be a bit brisk. Three stars, Ivanka Klump. <laughs> I bought this book over 100 years ago and it still feels fresh. Dr. Emmett Brown, Time Traveler. Two droopy thumbs up, Salvador Dali. Thanks. <laughs> I fucking love it. That shit was so funny. Alright. Let's take a peek. Ooh. It's got that crunch to it. Alright. Ooh, these are cool. Also, if you don't want... Uh, if you don't want spoilers for this book, like if you're waiting for your own book to come, then... Yeah. The foreword is by Murdoch, of course it is. Okay, I guess I'll read this. Okay, foreword by Murdoch and Nichols. Uh oh, I'm leaving. Am I leaving oil? I'm leaving oil prints all over this book already. That's not good. Yeah, you can even see it in the camera right here. What's up with that? Is the paper. A specific kind of paper? Uh oh. <laughs> I already ruined it, guys. Oh well. It's meant to be looked through. I'm not gonna. I can't buy it and then not look through it, even if it means getting my fingers all gross. I'm just looking at. Oh! <laughs> I'm just looking at these fucking pictures. This is a kind of cool one. I, this is kind of cool. Because I, it's so out of Jamie's, like, art style. And I'm curious as to how this one was done. Uh, if it was, like, 3D rendered or something like that. Also, I don't know why. No, that didn't help. I got this glare from my, uh, from my fucking window going on. Sorry about that. It's actually way darker in my room than it looks, and I apologize about that. I can't fix the brightness right now. Oh, that one's cool too. I love the, this one is really cool. I love the 3D look to a lot of these. Young Hogs, that's so cool. Lords of Shepherds Prince. I, okay, so, I hated looking at Merlog with his hair slicked back, back when, it, like, he first did it, but from this angle, it looks so much better. There are, he's got his good angles, and he's got his bad angles. The Cloud of Unknowing, oh my god, I love that song. Fire coming out of a monkey's head. These are so cool. I like that there's a lot of Murdoch art in this. <laughs> oh, so we got Murdoch and the Boogeyman hanging out. Yeah, a lot of this is Murdoch, unless there's gonna be more uh, of the other characters. These are cool. Um, it's still there. Is that supposed to be the head of Sean? Ooh. Adding lore, so Sean is probably dead. Uh, Sean Ryder. I don't know if he's actually dead, like, in real life, but in the Gorillas universe, it seems he's dead. All the zombie monkeys got kind of, like, an upgrade in, like, the way they look right here. Uh, they, they actually kind of look more people-y. And I guess more like a threat. Okay, no, that's 2D. I was supposed to say, that's... I was gonna say, no way is that Murdoch with 2D's uh, clown mask. The car park of good and evil. Building the flying islands, the windmill. I love the colors he uses, they're really cool. It's so stylized, and I love it. Like, this look is good. But because it's not like face on, it's kind of at an angle. 2D looks good too. I'm sorry. I know I. Murdoch's my favorite, so I have to gush. Ooh, the colors on this one are super cool. The pastels on it are super cool. Neat. Okay. C c cover up those Tootsie's noodle. 
I don't have a foot fetish. Blue hair zombie. He lost his charger. Now he's roaming, searching for it endlessly. Lost his charger. Charger is in like the person keeping charge of him. His charge, like the person who keeps him, which would be Murdoch. Murdoch, Murdoch is his charge. I don't know if he still is technically his charge or if that's gone now. Oh, okay, so 2D was a zombie. I think this is, is this supposed to be a Genji though? Genji Ito reference? I don't know this one. I can't read this because it's uh, in Japanese. Murdoch is Dracula and Hobbs is some kind of monster. The hip hop abomination. That's so cool. <laughs> bum, st bum strokers. Of course it'd be bum strokers instead of bra Bram Stoker. And Bram Stoker. Jared Cody Wolf. Wait, are these different art styles? Done so these aren't all done by Jamie. It looks like some of them maybe are done by other people who work with Jamie. <laughs> this is cool. Lift knife. <laughs> okay. Oh, Tootie's cute. Look at him. <laughs> that looks cool. William Ray. That looks really neat. So these are. I want. I do wonder if these are people. Gorillas at war. Can you imagine how crazy it would have been to uh, see? Like, because back during World War One and Two, I think it was One and Two, and it was either just Two or it was both wars. But during World War One and Two, they had like the cartoons that did like the propaganda campaign animation stuff. Can you imagine if gorillas did one? Just for shits and giggles. Hey! Oh my God! <laughs> it's fucking Murdoch and the Powerpuff Girls art style. It looks so much more normal. <laughs> He's just hanging out with the gang, the, the gang green gang. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. <laughs> They're so cute. I wonder if that's who he. That, he's so he. So when he went to jail, did he get stuck with the gang green gang, and that's why he managed to be fine in it? These are very stylized and simple. I don't like the way Tootie looks. Ru Russell looks fine. Noodle looks like a Powerpuff Girl, a beefy Powerpuff Girl. I know that's the jacket. I like that. It's very simple and make a really cool tattoo. Glyne Dillon. Oh, are these gonna. I probably said that wrong, I'm sorry. Are these gonna be paintings? Yeah, photos of the same painting, maybe? <laughs> I guess so. Uh, EPHK. Oh no, I'm gonna kill it. It looks so cool. What the hell? Oh, it's like a uh, fighting moves. That's what it is. Okay, I see. Oh, that looks really cool. Sorry, this whole video is gonna be me going, ooh, ah, really cool, because it is. I love seeing. <laughs> okay, I love. <coughs> I love seeing realistic art of them because um <laughs> because it's interesting to see how they would look as like legit real people and such <laughs> it looks like such a troll <laughs> i fucking love him so that's cyborg i love that they still left his cape on him but it looks really long on for Whatever reason, I'm not. I'm looking at the cave. I swear, I'm not. His boots are really cool. There's so much detail. There's a there's a lot of detail. <laughs> I'm gonna turn the page because I keep having to like lean in close to like look at the small details, and I feel gross about it. Tara Ballin Billinger, Viva Chain. Oh, this style's cute. Oh my god, this style's like so, so fucking zany. I love this though. Everyone looks amazing. Why does this style look familiar? Looks like a something from Cartoon Network. 
I love the reoccurring theme of Daffy Duck. Andre Carrillo. Who got the one? Whoa, it's a lot of colors. Oh, is that Chaney and Damon down here at the bottom? <laughs> they look so goofy. Wait, which one's which? Um, uh oh. Um, fuck. Chaney. Damon has the bigger ears. Does Jamie have a bigger nose? Yeah, okay, so I think this one is Damon and this one is Jamie. I think they gave Jamie the bigger nose and Damon... I don't know. Th that's my best guess. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Very cool. Of course, Murdox is all fire and... A tank. Oh, and you got Noodle over here. Why is he just standing there like that? <laughs> just standing around. This is giving me such big Cartoon Network vibes. 2021. Yeah. Venla Lina. Oh, look at the monkey. You're such a cute little monkey. Oh, that looks really cool. Is that Noodle? That's a cool picture of Noodle. She looks. She's always looked like a badass. Daniela Uli. I apologize again if I say something wrong. This is cool too. This hyper realistic yet cartoon style. And they're all of Noodle. Uh oh. Got hooked on the cord. Get off the cord! Stop. Or the cord get off my boat. Look at this. This looks really cool. I just realized you guys haven't been able to see the other side of it. Um, this looks so cool. Neat. Saner. How, what kind of weird ass shit is this gonna turn into? Oh, it's actually pretty normal. So we have 2D the Fool, Murloc hanging out with a bunch of swans, and Noodle sitting on a cow. Wait, I didn't see Russell. Man. Oh, Russell's right there. He's in the bath. It's his time for the bath. Sharing is caring. <laughs> Nicholas Degani, of course. Ooh, the whole- I love that it's a close-up, and then you see the whole thing, and the whole thing is super cool. Murdoch's got the bandana going on. Tootie's got the hat. Del! Del and Russell. This is so cool. These are all so cool. Sorry, I got sidetracked all of a sudden. Oh, is this Noodle hanging out on- the island and her little self? Or is this someone just hanging out with Noodle? The self insert, if you will. Tim McCourt and Max Taylor. Very gorillas as. Yeah, these have to be the people who draw for. who help draw with Jamie. That's really cool. I like the colors. Jen's, Cla Jen's Clayson's. Are these pastels or or paint or oils? I mean, are they like chalk pastels or oil pastels? <laughs> Y'all knew what I meant. Oh, look at the gator with the fins! So cute. No. <laughs> oh, they got Jack Black to draw some. That's awesome. It says it, I know you can't read it, but it says Jack Black right there in the circle. The names of the people are right there. I want to see Jack Black's drawings. Is that supposed to be? <laughs> is that supposed to be Jack Black? <laughs> Gorillas and Tenacious D. <laughs> I love <laughs> Jack Black. Cracks me up. Gregory Hergert, Hergert, Herger. One of those is right. Oh, that's cool. He looks way huge in that car. Oh my god. Super cool. Tootie looks kind of like a badass. Hang on, I'm gonna lift it up. Tootie looks kind of like a badass. And Murdoch's a fucking goof as always. But I like his fit. Murdoch's always got great style. Robert Valley, August 15, 1987, D-Day.
Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. This is when... Fucking... When they got a hold of him. I love that they were all kind of connected with each other right from the <laughs> laid back. Hell yeah. Right from the beginning. Miss Jisoo. Oh uh, yeah, Shining reference. Of course, gotta have one. Dana Terrence. Terrace. Oh, that's awesome. And it's not just because it's more obvious. It should be quite cool. Anna Godis. I bet I want the whole one of this. Look, yeah. Looks really cool. It's got this cool anime style to it. Whoa, oh, wait, okay, it took me a moment to realize what I was looking at. I'm looking at 2D when he was young before his hair turned blue and fell out. Because the whole thing is that he fell out of a tree when he was young and uh, all his hair fell out. And when it grew back, it was blue. He was so cute. I like that they gave him blue eyes because I always imagine him having blue eyes as well. He looked like such an anime character, and I'm here for it. He was so handsome. I mean, he's still cute, but he was handsome when he had eyeballs. Eric Fountain. Very interesting style. Oh, <laughs> I was wondering. Why is Murdoch always let, like cropped out of the like close-up pictures? This one's really cool. It gives me Ed and Eddie vibes. More pastels, it looks like. Pastels. Lots of pastels. <laughs> this this style is kind of interesting as well. It's a little odd to look at. I mean, also sorry if I get quiet because I'm admiring the art and because I, I, I really like it. Um. So I guess I'll just do like a quick, I'm gonna try to like quickly run through this. So this is really cool because I, I think it's all Jamie's stuff in the beginning and then it's the people he works with or has or has worked with uh, then doing their art of it. There's a lot of love in these pictures. Like, you can just tell when something's drawn and say, Oh my god, I love this style of foodie. This, like, clothing style. This Japanese uh, streetwear look. Russell's is cool too, but I really like Tootie's. He looks badass. There's naked hap There's naked happenings. <laughs> it's almost like, what am I looking at? There's a weird streak right there. Interesting. Got noodle with a cage on her head. Cage on her head. Russell nailing down Jesus. And then you got Tootie hanging out with Snake Lady, and you got Murdoch over there playing the piano naked, as he does. I don't know why I got Labyrinth vibes all of a sudden. Oh, is this how Cyborg was found? She just slapped the gun out of his hand. She just slapped. Well, she didn't kill them, so that's good. She just... So, over here. Where's my boy at hiding over, around here? Is Murdoch hiding out? Some oh, yeah, right there. <laughs> I couldn't see him for some reason. Very cool, very good and cool. More oils. What? what what's that? If I... What happens if I scan that? And a catish. Huh? You gonna give me a virus? That was cute. Dell. I'm always happy to see Dell. Oh, these are very cool. Very minimalistic. But they get their, their point across. Very cool. Cool, cool, cool. Rough Mercy. These are also very really cool. Uh, can you imagine painting something like this on your face with like makeup that would look amazing 
Oh, is this when Noodle got dragged down the hill instead of Murdoch by accident? Oh yeah, because Murdoch would go to j go to hell frequently to visit. But then you saw Noodle there, and actually the story goes as he she got out here herself, but. I like this too, where he just saw her there and he was like, fuck that, and saved her. Because she's his baby. R like, whether he likes it or not, <laughs> he's a dad. <laughs> They're all dads. <laughs> it also gives me a chance to... Okay, this is going to sound, I guess, like a, being a perv. But I like seeing them shirtless or with minimal clothes, because I like being able to see how the bodies are drawn, because I suck at drawing bodies, so, but that's just me. Del the Funky Homo Sapien, he did artwork, oh he did that one artwork of Russell, that's cute, actually, it's pretty cute. Little Thunder, oh that's neat, this is like phase one gorillas, because Murdoch's brown, tan, tan brown. The color brown. The color tan. They're so cute! Yeah, she's a cutie. We're almost at the end here. Oh, okay. Well, some of this is a little, you know, but whatever. If you're, oh, if you're younger than, like, 16, you shouldn't even be on my channel. Boy, boys and the lady playing poker. We got nothing to lose. Oh, you got some stuff to lose. Brendan McCarthy. Is it Paul McCarthy's son? Cool. Uh, okay. Big old, big old TV lady. I'm down. Oh, uh, is it like sad that MTV is on. Oh, is this the last one? Yep, last one. Okay, what a strong note to end off on. Okay, so that was the entirety... Sorry, I don't mean to throw shit at y'all. That was the entirety of the Gorilla's art book. We looked at every page, and I talked some. <laughs> I'm gonna move y'all back up. Hi. How's it going? Okay, so that was the entirety of the art book. We're done. That was, that's, that's the whole video. I got nothing else to say. I just wanted to show you guys this. So. Alright, so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you like what you see, which I don't know why you would. Uh, um, <laughs> sorry, um. Hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment, I don't care. Leave a negative comment, leave a positive comment, whatever you fucking want. Um, happy Pride Month. Or I guess Pride is over. Pride Month's over. Pride Month is never over. Pride, Pride is all year long. <laughs> uh, and no, I did not go to any Pride parades. It is too hot. I prefer to stay inside. Sorry. Um, but, yeah. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video... Uh, you can, uh, you, got, you guys know, y'all you, know, y'all know the drill, alright, bye.